Berry Hill K-8 is the last school in Mecklenburg County that is not served by public utilities. What that means is it's 2024 and the school has a well and its own wastewater treatment plant. And so we are very excited about the opportunity to relocate that school. So the project is actually to replace Berry Hill with a new Berry Hill school off-site where there is access to sewer and water and all of the things that we need to make sure we're providing the best learning environments for our students. So this school will open to students in August of 2028. And um, we are right now getting ready to gear up to, to, to solicit for designers and for the construction management firms who will be working on this project. So we encourage folks to stay engaged and keep up with our procurement website and, and know about those opportunities to, to, to participate in this project. The students will actually remain at the current Berry Hill. We'll keep that in operation. We'll build the new Berry Hill School off-site. And when the school is ready in August of 28, we'll open to the students who are currently in Berry Hill. So it'll be within its attendance boundary. Um, it's just a replacement school like we've done with other schools. Um, Newell was a school that we replaced off-site. So this is something that we have a history of doing. And again, the opportunity here is to get access to, to sewer and water, as well as provide a great facility for teaching and learning. Mary Hill is one of the schools that was built at a time where there was an open classroom model. So there are classrooms within Berry Hill that uh, were subdivided in order to create separate spaces. And now those classrooms, some of them don't have windows. There are partition walls that don't go all the way to the ceiling. So noise transfers from room to room. So you're in a room that's not um, lit by, by daylight. You're in a room where you can hear what's going on in the two, three, four classrooms next to you. And so it's not a very conducive environment for staff or students to do their best work. And that's one of the reasons we're very excited about creating a new barrier.